the day that I was fearing would eventually come. And yeah, there's really no easy way to get into this. So let's just get on with the video. What's going on, everyone? It's your boy Ush, and of course, we all back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? So, um, yeah, Fortnite, a game that is no secret, I don't like. I don't like playing it. I don't like Battle Royales, aside from Fall Guys, but I don't look at Fall Guys as a Battle Royale. I look at Fall Guys as like an MXC game. If you don't know what MXC is, then you probably weren't around back in the day during the golden age of TV, but that's besides the point. Stuff like Ninja Warrior, things like that, that's what I look at. That's basically how I perceive Fall Guys. And Right now, with this current age of gaming and a lot of things being free to play and cross play, cross progression, and all that, battle royales are kind of one of the staple genres that currently exist in today's current era and climate of video games, entertainment, and whatnot. Fortnite, I guess you can argue or just flat out say that they're at the helm, they're at the 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 top of the, the, the mountain when it comes to that. And people across the world on all platforms, literally on all platforms are playing this game. And it just so happens that the most recent collaboration is with Dragon Ball. So I have a trailer here. It's 51 seconds long. I've seen screenshots. I've seen leaked things. And I was very unsure if those things were actually real or not because of how terrible it looked so i figured i'd reserve my final impressions and reaction um, and any other opinions and thoughts that i would have for this video so let's get right into it okay here goes nothing i see goku's foot in the corner so let's see, let's see Are you serious? They they're not serious, are they? Oh my god! D D wait, 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 wait. You mean to tell me that they spent however much to acquire the rights to do this collab and this is what the this is what the fucking this is what the outfits look like? This is worse than those episodes in Super that were animated terribly. This makes those look like they were done by Shintani or someone that, you know, actually did high quality shit. What the f- What am I looking at? Okay, let's- Bro, the Nimbus looks better than the actual models. I can't even believe this. Kamehameha's, of course. Oh my God, the leak was real. This is this is legit. They were serious. Wow, you could ride on Shenron. The few. So they got Goku going all the way up to Ultra Instinct, huh? Cool. Okay, um, I'm very upset, not even gonna lie. I, w I never thought that I'd be upset for the reasons that I'd be upset about. And here's the reality, right? I always imagined that the, the, the one time or the first time we'd ever see Goku and the gang officially collaborate or cross over into another game would be Smash Brothers. Because let's face it, Smash Brothers has been like one of the first of now many games that would feature you know that exact thing the idea of crossing over with other genres and whatnot and yeah i'm sure i'm gonna get people that are gonna be like but uchi sakurai already pointed out that he wanted only video game characters da 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 da, da. and i was like exactly and i figured that goku would be the first to break that rule that was in place for smash right i just figured that because looking at how sakurai was Sakurai or Sakurai is he would always have restrictions or like these things that he would put onto himself and the game and 
over time, I mean, the opinions and things can change. For the longest time, this man said that he was not going to have Ridley in the game. He said that over and over and over until finally here comes ultimate and there goes Ridley. So it's just like that's a small example to share because my point is that even when they say one thing, things can change, especially um, a little little known fact called popular demand, all right? Because that speaks volumes. So I figured that it would be dope if Goku and, you know, wh whoever would just, you know, go into Smash because, you know, it would be fire and it would make it would make a lot of sense. Now, that did not happen. However, one thing that I will note that Sakurai did point out was that he believed or he said that it would be difficult to work with mangaka to have something like that happen. And here comes Fortnite all these years later where it seems like all it really takes is you just have to drop a bag. That's it. You just have to drop a bag. And, and, and honestly, that's realistically what it is. Fortnite is, is not even just a video game anymore. It's a fucking ad space. Why do you think all these other companies at this point, they've established a very nice uh, resume for themselves. They have so many players actively playing and supporting it and buying into all their outfits and whatnot. It's basically ad space. Anytime a Marvel movie show starts up, look at how many out outfits that they have. Look how many things they have promoting all of those projects going forward. Back when Multiverse of Madness was about to come out, Wanda was in there. Strange was in there. Anything Star Wars related, they have hella Star Wars. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, it, 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 Fortnite is ad space now. That is how you can get more people attracted to your shit. That's how that's why crossovers exist in the first place. And so now, here we have Dragon Ball with Fortnite. And that is what they gave us. People are going to spend money on the worst models I've ever seen of those characters. I've seen way better models. Dude, they could have ripped the freaking Budokai Tenkaichi models and they would have looked a hundred times better. They, I don't even understand. Like they, they don't even look like they, they belong in there. That's the thing. Like they compared to, and standing next to all the other models that we see, and I'm not even going to go back and look at that trailer. That shit looked atrocious. I don't want to show that off again. That's crazy. That's really crazy. I don't even know if I am the only one to even feel like this. And honestly, I don't even care, but that is how you know that I keep it completely real because <laughs> Y'all know on my main channel, I cover Dragon Ball. Full Power Podcast is a Dragon Ball centric podcast. And I keep it a hundred the entire way through. I don't hold back and I'm not gonna hype something up that doesn't deserve to be hyped. I feel like they should fucking update those models. They gotta do something. And I don't know what, but color me surprised when I'm telling you that. I would have expected a lot more. I saw that they got Naruto in there. Naruto, Kakashi, Sakura, Sasuke. They got models in there. They look okay. Why the fuck? How did they fumble on Dragon Ball? That's crazy. The fucking Nimbus looks better. The Nimbus, everything else looks fine. Shenron. But you got Goku and Vegeta looking like they came out of a fucking dollar store. That's, that's insane. Am I going to spend a single dollar on this? Absolutely the fuck not. I have yet to... Spend a single dollar on Fortnite. Will I play this? I feel like the real the real answer is I feel like I will get dragged into playing it at some point just because I got family and I got friends that play this game. So here's a quick plug to my Twitch. If you guys want to watch me play uh, games live and interact with me live, there's your, you know, the link is always going to be in the description below in all the videos. I'm very upset and not impressed at all all with this collaboration i'm actually kind of let down i did say this though and i will and i uh, this this goes with me keeping it real if they did put broly in it i would definitely buy the character that'd be the first time i'd make a purchase just because i'm with the broly guy but like dude just looking at how bad they looked here i don't even think i would want to buy fucking broly if, if they ever went that far because i know that capcom they got hella street fighter characters in here so i don't know if this this will be like you know this is the first wave of dragon ball because you know i can see them adding more and it's very interesting that they decided to do goku vegeta beerus and bulma they make sense i mean it's fortnite the, Nothing makes sense, and that's why it makes sense. There you have it. There's my two cents.
It sucks. I don't like it. They look ugly. Like, share, subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter. All the all that good stuff. Supporting links are gonna be in the description as always. Make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves. Make the power protect. Keep it locked loaded right here on this channel. Stay safe. Stay clean. Stay the hell away from Fortnite. And I'll see you guys.